everybody. Playing. F playing Freddy. Ma'am. Playing Freddy Fish again today. Um, this is. Where's Luther? Oh. He was setting up the camera. Cousin Calico to teach us all about raising hogfish. It was nice. You'll be glad for the help. It's hard to run a big ranch all by yourself. It is. Will we get to wear 10-gallon hats? I think a 5-gallon hat is more your size. Come on, oh, let's poor Luther. I'm at least 7 gallons, Freddy. Six and a half minimum. So yeah, today we're playing Freddy Fish and the Rustlers and the hog in the case of the hogfish rustlers. This one I don't think I owned until like ages later. But yeah, and then the next one is my favorite one of all time. So There's cousin Calico's ranch. So we're playing we're this one and then soon. So we'll play this one and then the next one and then we're on to Pajama Sam, I believe. I don't know what I've said. I've probably said a different thing Hi, for everything. Cousin Calico. But we'll figure oh, it out. Hello, Freddy. Howdy, Luther. We're ready to help out. Which way to the hogfish? Hmm. Well, it seems we got a little problem there. See, oh, no. The prize-winning hogfish herd is being rustled. Rustled? What does that no. mean? Somebody came and took them without asking. That's not right. No, they stole them. not. And a hogfish requires proper care. Bad. I think they might be in real trouble. Aww. I just don't know what to do. Did you call the police? I think the sheriff's gone out of town, and I need to stay here at the ranch in case the hogfish get away and come home. That's not, not good. Not to mention all the worrying I have to do. We'll <laughs> help you, Cousin Same Calico. Fam. Luther Same. and I will find the hogfish and catch those rustlers. All right. Yeah. Thank you both. You'll be doing me a real good turn. We are going to find the hogfish. Purple sea urchin. Look, Freddy! A purple sea urchin! Yum, yum, yum. Don't eat them. We're rich! Do, do, do. Oh! Where are we going? Where are we going first? This must be the town square! Let's go ask some of the people who live here if they know anything about those rustlers. Okay, let's go speak to this guy. This guy's cool. Customers! Oh, Jesus. It's okay. <clears throat> Hello and welcome to Just Buckles. I'm Nelson Tosso. How Hello, can I Nelson. Help you today? I'm Freddy, and this is Luther, and we're helping my cousin, Calico Catfish. Rustlers took all of her hogfish. <gasps> Rustlers? Well, I wouldn't know anything about that. You do be sus, bro. You do be sus, bro. Alright. That's blocked so far. So let's go here instead. Oh yeah, I think they spit in the bucket. And change colour. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish. And this is my best friend, Luther. I'm Perry. Hey, Perry. Perry the platypus. Ooh. Let's speak to this lass. Howdy, youngsters. I'm Saltwater Stella, owner and operator of the Soda Loon. What can I do for you? We wanted to ask you if you've seen any rustlers around here lately. Rustlers? Well, there were a couple of suspicious characters in here yesterday. They might have been rustlers. They sat at that table right over there. <gasps> oh, boy. With a Maybe note. They the Thank you. With a note. Look, Freddy, maybe this is a clue. Is it a clue? Meet Someone ate at it. The Rusty Rustler at High Tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. Seven, three, two. I'll bet the Rustlers left this. I wonder why they didn't eat the note like it says. It probably tastes like paper. We'll yeah, hang on to it. Probably the don't want to eat it. Combination must be important. Seven three two, I think it was. Okay.
Yeah. Hi. It's me. Listen. I want to talk to you about that note. Dun dun dun. He's suspicious. This way. Let's go. <gasps> is it? Is this Come a boat? Come on. Let's check out that hatch. Okay. Let's check out the boat. I think somebody's working. Sorry if there's like background noise, guys. <gasps> Wait, combination. Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. Seven, three, two. Oh, I'm a legend. I knew it. This shouldn't be too hard. We just have to punch in the combination. Okay. Nine, eight, seven, seven, one. Two. Three. Three. One. Two. Ugh. We did it! It's Ooh. open! Boy, I'll say! I guess the lock was the only thing holding the door on. Tom Farnett, what's that racket? Someone's coming! Hurry! Aw, oh, fiddlesticks! Fiddle six. The door came off again. Well, I guess I'll just have to sit here and stand guard. I wonder if they still called it standing guard if you're sitting down. What happened to Spongehead? That must be one of the rustlers. <laughs> oink, oink, oink. I Piggy. hear the hogfish in there. Let's go, Luther. Excuse me, sir. It's rustlers only in the hideout. Oh, in the hideout. I didn't think I was supposed to say it was a hideout. We might be rustlers. How do you know we're not rustlers? That's easy. You're not dressed like rustlers. If you were a rustler, you'd have a ten-gallon hat like mine, a belt buckle like mine, and a fashionable bow tie. All rustlers dress exactly alike? Yep, we all wear the latest rustler gear. You can see from this picture in Rustlemania magazine. Hmm, a blue 10 gallon hat, a big old belt buckle with an L on it, and a bow tie. Since you're not wearing these things, you must not be rustlers. Just pass that information you, over. This hideout is for rustlers only. <laughs> <coughs> okay, thank you. This is the rustler hideout, all right. I'm sure the hogfish are inside. What are we going to do? We've got to get some new clothes. We gotta dress up. Plain dress up. I don't know why we don't just swim up here, but I mean, that's that's not my business. Keys. All right, you hogfish, quiet down or else, or else I'm calling Mr. Big. Squid Farmer? Did you hear something? It was probably just the current. I guess. Oh, that area is clear now. Yes. Do 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 do. That's a nice screwdriver you have there. Thanks. Do you think we could borrow it for a while? No, we might need it to work on this dance floor. Maybe later when it's finished. Okay, let's go this way. Can I have that bow tie? My name's Freddy Fish, and this is my best pal, Luther. Howdy, kids. Folks call me Sahara Slim. Professional traveling man and blues musician. Musician? Do you play an instrument? Harmonica. Can I have the bow tie? Where's your harmonica, Slim? We'd like to hear you play. Well, I got a little song about that. Listen here. Oh, I used to play harmonica all the live long day. But now I miss my Monica. I traded it away. Aww. 
genius. I traded my harmonica for the apple of my. I traded away my monica for a ratty old bow tie. You traded your harmonica for a bow tie? Yeah, I wish I hadn't now. Okay, let's find him his harmonica and borrow the bow tie. <gasps> oh crap, oh, yeah, I had boy. to get the wood. See another purple sea urchin. I'm a guess. It's always different. Seven by seven. This should be useful. You should be careful you don't get splinters. Ooh, up or sideways, up or sideways, up or uh, sideways first. Oh! I'm Freddy. I'm pretty and sure we can, can yeah. Luther. We can it's go inside nice and mouth. meet you both. My name is Luke. Boy, Fluke. You must have a really big mouth. Uh, I, I mean, that didn't come out <laughs> right. That's okay. Silly head. I knew what you meant. And it is big. That's how come I get to be the town cabaret. Cabaret? What's that? We have plays, singing, and different kinds of acts right inside my mouth. That's neat. Can we see? Well, the cabaret's closed right now. But sure, take a look. Guys, if anybody's just like, step inside my mouth, don't do it. Hey, this is neat. Hey, look, it's a 10-gallon hat. Oh, boy. Oh, it's stuck in there pretty good. Gonna have to brush teeth. Yeah. Okay, we'll come back to brush your teeth. Pretty cool mouth, dude. Okay, let's go up. Ooh, a pulley system. Ooh, jump. Oh, we're okay, we need to find a pulley. That sounded like Luther just fought. Ooh. Oh, right. Gee, there's a porthole. Oh. Let's try to get over there. Yeah. Cause yeah, you gotta use the pulley to pull that down to fill it up to get across. Yeah. We can't get in there. Okay, so we gotta go back for that. Wish there was a place like this, like where I live, where they were just like, oh, free wood um, if you need it. Keep them on ice until I get back. Stop. Sign it, you know who. And deliver it right away. It's urgent. Yes, sir. Oh. What's up, dude? <clears throat> well, hi, kids. Hello. Everyone be acting sus, man. What's down here? Hello. Are you the mailman? No. I'm Freddy Fish. Go away. I'm waiting for an important package. Honestly, that sounds like me. Oh, no. It's missing a handle on the lid. That's why the lid <laughs> won't shut. That sounds like me. Whenever I order something, I'm like, nobody talk to me until this package arrives. Uh, let's go. Let's go up this way. Is there something on that that I need? Oh, th that there's a guy. guy spinning on the propeller. Okay, I'll 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 get you out, man. I'll get the purple sea hey, urchin Luther, first. What's round and purple and pokey? It, is it on me? No. It can't be round really? and pokey. It's a purple sea urchin over there. Oh. I wasn't. Oh, sorry, Luther. I didn't mean to cut you off. I think I heard something. I don't know if I saved him, considering there's still sounds. Nope. Just slid him down. Okay, does it have to go all the way? 
Was I just silly? I think that did something. Not something good. I'm... I'm literally just guessing this. Does it tell me how to... Dude, how do I turn it off? Whoa, Nelly! Whoa! Okay. I'm so sorry, my man. Stop this crazy thing! I think that did something. Oh, this isn't helping. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sorry. Red? Red means stop. I think I heard something. Doesn't sound too good. I'm gonna just try to. Did that fix it? No. Okay. You. I think I heard. There we go. I don't know how it was meant to. Oh, it... is it because it's an orange handle? So, are you okay? I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best friend, Luther. Hi. Well. Pleased to meet you. I'm Sheriff Shrimp, the local lawman. Oh. I'll shake your fins, but as you can see, I'm a little tied up right now. Okay, um... Watch this, Freddy. I learned all about knots in the oh, Fish no. Scouts. Good job, Luther. Um... Sheriff Zachariah Shrimp is in your debt. If there's ever anything you need, why, you just ask. Well, as a matter of fact, there are some rustlers who... But I must be off. There's law breaking afoot somewhere. I can oh, smell God. it. But... Sir, we need your you help. there! No loitering! <clears throat> uh, Freddy! What? Oh! I'm sorry, Luther. Wow, that's amazing. I was in Do it the again. Scouts too. Do it again. Pick it up. This could come in handy. I don't know. I can I dye that to make it the boat? No, I think I'll have to get it from the guy if I find his harmonica. Mailman! Looks like the wheel on this wagon has fallen off. Maybe we can fix it. Here we go. Oh. The wheel looks like it just needs a new nut to hold it onto the square. wagon. Square. We need we need to remember. Square. It's gotta be square. Hmm. Are you ready to oh. start? No, sorry. I didn't know that, that was gonna be a mini game. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best buddy, Luther. Hello, I'm you. That's silly. You're not Freddy. I'm no, you. you, like the letter U. Just you? Is it short for something? Yes, it's short for Uriah, Jedediah, Euripides, Algernon, Fortescue, Forsyth, and... Um, oh, now, what was the rest of it? Um, we'll just call you you. Most folks do. I was about to say, a note fell behind him before, and I don't know if it, like, fell out of there if you wait a certain amount of time and you can pick it up, or... Nah, maybe not. I was like, watch it happen that one time. So, we need a squ... Oh, yeah, because we've, we've only been to, like, one side. We haven't gone the other way yet. I could speed run these games. Okay, so we've been one way. Let's see if the 7x7 seven seven was correct. I doubt it, but I hope. You two look like you've got trouble. <laughs> you can say that again. Got trouble? We made this floor for the big square dance tomorrow. Only we found out it has to be, well, square. And we are out of wood. We need some more to start over. A piece about five feet by five feet ought to do it. Damn. Here, can you use this piece of wood for your floor? I think that's too large. Can't you cut it to make it smaller? It. No, no, no. My nose is still tired from doing the round one. We need a piece that's five feet by five feet. I see. God, it made my job difficult. Let's just go do that really quick before I forget. 
I think it was this way. Yes. We should probably only take one piece. So I'll put this other one back. Okay. So now we got one that's five feet by five feet. We can give it to them. It's the one time it's a small one. That's not gonna do me any good. It's a piece of wood. There we go. Here, can you use this piece of wood for your floor? Say, that looks about right. Perfect. Thanks a lot. We owe you one. You're welcome. Poor guy. Jesus Christ. Okay. Our work here is done. Are you Clinkies. thinking what I'm thinking? Coffee break? Exactly. Clinkies. Now that your now? floor is finished, do you think we can borrow your screwdriver for a while? Sure. In fact, you can keep it. Consider awesome. it payment for a job well done. Gee, thanks. Awesome, we got a screwdriver. Now let's go up the stairs, because we haven't been here yet. Good evening, ma'am. Sir, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Gil Barker, <gasps> and I represent the Biloxi Premium Gum he and was Wheel Nut Company, third largest distributor of bubble gum and wheel nuts in the Upper Western that Hemisphere. Was the weirdest combination. I'm Freddie Fish, and this is my pal Luther. My employers have authorized me to clear out my inventory to make room for next year's models. Everything must go. Therefore, I. Gil Barker will be offering you prices so outrageously low that you'll have to bend over to see them. Those are fickle fit locking wheel nuts. The I need finest wheel nuts ever made. They come I need in a to square one. Of shapes guaranteed to fit any wheel made after square. 1986. And if it doesn't fit, you can take advantage of our liberal exchange policy. Fickle fit nuts are all currently available at one low price. Just three purple sea urchins per nut. Awesome. What's this note first? Friendly reminder to Gil Barker. You owe Shady Shark 20 clams. Pay up pronto. What's this? Oh, that's, uh, that's nothing. It's a poem I was writing. That's an awfully strange poem. You be sus, my dude. We'd like to buy one of your wheel nuts, please. Okay, cool. So that's one, two, three. You can select. This Square. one looks good. Thank you. No, thank you. Let's buy another wheel nut. I don't think we need one. Okay, so we got a nut. Good evening, <gasps> sir. May I interest you in... You got the 20 clams you owe me, Gil? Uh, not exactly. How much is not exactly? I've got a few purple sea urchins. You know, my dogfish needs an operation. Don't worry. I've got a really big deal uh, about to go down. Yeah? What is it? All I can say is, it's really big. I'll have your clams in a couple of days. Well, okay. Whatever you got going, I hope it's good. Oh, it is. It's real good. Sus. Oh, left to right, left to right, left to right. Da, 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 this way. Oh, hello, fish. Wow, that's amazing! You should see my brother! Oh. Can we get through, please? 
Do you think you could let us by? Sorry, can't. Why is that? I think I'm stuck. Okay. Cool. Okay, what about here? Can go this way. Oh, jellyfishes. <gasps> we made it. Purple I sea knew urchin. We could do it. Look, and that. Ready. A purple sea urchin. Woohoo! We're rich. It's a crank handle. What's a crank handle? Here all by itself. Shouldn't it be attached to something? Yeah. Maybe. I doubt it belongs in this cave. I wonder how it got in here anyway. Good question. Oh, thank you, jellyfish. It's ever so thoughtful of you. Okay, now let's go back and see what we can do to... That, I can't do anything that way yet. Okay, so we're here to put this on here now, now that we can do that. We did it. It's fixed, and it'll stay on there, right? We don't have to use any glue or anything. Careful there. Don't ever mention G-L-U-E around old Elmer. Spoops him something awful. Mm. What's he got against glue? <laughs> oh no! I oh, used his antenna to hold it on. At last. Same. Same, my dude. Awesome. Mr. Tippett. We'll take that. Do you think we could have this old mailbox door now that you're not using it anymore? Sure. Take it and leave me to hermit in peace. Awesome. Thank you. This way? Um... Oh, crank handle. Okay, yeah. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to speed up some of the moving just so you guys aren't watching for like an hour. There. It fits perfectly. Now wind I it up. I knew that handle belonged somewhere. Wind it up. Wind him up. There we are. What are you doing? Hang on, guys. My doggo wants out. We did it, Luther. Why is the room spinning? <laughs> Same. It's not, Luther. You are. Oh, that's better. So now, when we go up here, we should be able to get into that boat. Yeah. Hey, look! This place is filled with water now! Awesome. Oh, is his harmonica... <gasps> oh, boy! I see another purple sea urchin! I think, yeah, we had to get Pepper to make that kid sneeze so he doesn't puff up. Didn't we need an L? Look at this cute spice container. This could come in handy. Yeah, we need that. But didn't we need an L? So this is what we need to look like wrestlers. Hmm. A blue ten gallon hat. A big old belt buckle with an L on it and a bow tie. We don't have any of those things. We'd better get cracking. I was about to say, where's the L here? MSG. So let's fill this up with pepper. A 
Okay. Now let's go see that kid. Oh, hang on. Let's no. Have another I just realized. Piece of yours. Sure. We can use the rope to get this out. Come on, Luther. Let's try this. The dental floss, yeah. Oh, How do people see Luther. out of these things? Oh, wait. There's an eye hole. I think you could use a little bit smaller hat. They make smaller ones? Poor Lisa. Thanks for the hat. Oh! Alright, you hot fish, pay attention. Oh, trying to get him to sleep. I've gone to a lot of trouble and expense to hire these sheep heads to jump over this fence for you. So count them and go to sleep. They're like, nope. Please? They said please. Please just go to sleep. Please? Awesome, we got the hat. Okay, let's try pepper on this kid. Here, try some pepper. Was you, Luther? <laughs> oh, yeah. That, that was me being an idiot. Oh, L. There we go. The harmonica. Hey. Now we're cooking with gas. Is it broken? I think maybe you just need some lessons. Hmm. This is harder than it looks. Okay, now let's get the L. Cat mine. Yeah, I That's guess you could do that without it. thumbs. Okay. Let's get gum. Don't know what we're using gum for. Give the harmonica to this guy and then yeah. we should be able to get Would the bow tie. you like this harmonica? Would I? Oh boy! Beautiful music. Well, oh, this is great! Oh, here, have this lovely bow tie in a Lovely bow tie. With my compliments. Thanks, hey. fam. Okay, um, what else do we need? Thank you so much. Now, I can play the blues again. He's pretty good. Gobi, I'm at my wit's end. Rockin'. I'm These rockin hogfish sure. are driving me crazy. They won't eat or sleep. And they're so noisy. Where'd they get the accordion? Accordion? Uh, I don't know. Did you try telling them that story about your trip to Akron? That always puts me to sleep. Oh, thanks a lot. I'm going to have to call Mr. Big again. 
<laughs> Don't call Mr. Big. Now I think if we go back to the like town, I think then we'll have everything we need. Because I can go to him to make the thing. Here, can you make us a belt buckle out of this? Sure, just bring me a letter to put on it and I'll get to work. I have, I have this. Here, this is for the belt buckle. <gasps> okay, stand back. Gloves on, guys. Something gonna blow up. Glue. My best work. All that's missing is a belt. Oh, Here you okay, go. Okay, he had it. I'm like, do I have to find that? Thank I you. swear I've never had to find that in my life. Yeah. Thanks, Mr. Torso. Please call me Nelson. Thanks, Nelson. You're a legend. <laughs> oh. I was like, what just happened to his hat? All I ever wanted was to be a hogfish rancher. I had no idea it would be so much work. Maybe there are some tricks to it that we don't know about. Yeah? Maybe. But I'm going back in. Don't let any non-rustlers inside, okay? Radio! He won't let any non-rustlers inside. We gotta make a blue hat with the octopus ink. Excuse me, Perry, can you spit in the bucket? Thanks, bro. Oh, Perry Winkle. Oh, Perry Winkle. Dunk. <laughs> Is that I didn't want to touch this. <laughs> I think the blue looks nicer. Blue looks good. Alright. We have everything we need to go deal with the hogfish rustlers now. I've like really hurt my face here. Okay, let's get dressed. What do you think? It might be a little big for you. But do I look like a ruffler? Oh! Yes! Okay, bow tie. Wow, that's kind of scary. I'd almost believe you were a rustler. Good, that's I what am. we want. And then the belt buckle. There, those rustlers won't be able to tell me apart from the real thing. It's a great outfit. It Luther, rockin'. You stay here while I try to get past the guard. Wait, I'm coming with you. Good thinking, Luther. Let's try to get past the guard. Smart kid. Hold it! This is a... Well, howdy, fellow wrestler. And howdy. I reckon Mr. Big must have sent you to help us out with the hogfish, right? Yeah. Um... Poor Mori, he's having a terrible time with the hogfish. Well, naughty, go on naughty in. He'll be glad to see you. Thank you. Where are the hogfish? We did it! Lisa, shh! We did it! We're inside! Which way do you think the hogfish are? Well, I think Follow I the hear noise. squealing coming from... Hey! 
You two aren't rustlers. What are you doing here? Um, we were just leaving. You're not going anywhere. Mr. Big will know. I love what how to do they're you. like, you're not thieves. In prison. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. What do we do now? They need the harmonica. It didn't even budge. Nope, this door is definitely locked. Trap door? Hey, it looks like there might be a way out under all these cannonballs. Phew, these are heavy. Yeah, that works. There, that does it. Genius. Swim, yeah. swim, swim. Fishies! Hey, look! Here they are! I didn't expect we to find them straight away. I thought I'd actually have fish, to get some right? stuff. We're not missing. Oh. We know just where we are. I have to break them out. Maybe we can get the hogfish out That's through this the hole. the thing that I the remember having to do. The hogfish won't fit through there, but it looks like you and I can. Ooh, be careful of splinters. I guess we'll have to work out another way to get those hogfish out. They'll need a bigger opening. That anchor looks really heavy. I'll bet that weighs six tons. What does that mean? That means it's really heavy. Oh. Right, we have to find a hook to attach to the other end, and the hook should be this way. Oh, right, okay, so we got to move that to get that hook. I thought the purple was a sea urchin for a second. Alright, let's do this. Hi to starboard, Ensign! Good job, Luther. Did you hear something? Like a creaking noise? I think it came from out there. Out there? Where the arrow was pointing. Aha! Look at this neat hook! Do you think maybe it belonged to a pirate? Arg. Be careful. I don't know, but I bet it will come in handy. Here, why don't you hang on to it? Okay. That, that'd be better. Thank you. Please. Okay, so attach the hook to here. Do, do, do. I bet if we attach this hook to the chain, it'll reach those bars. Let's give it a shot. Right. That is a teeny tiny hook. Alright, here we go. Push the button. This should free those hogfish. Luther, prepare to drop anchor. Ready, Freddy! Fire away! Boom. I'll rip the bar off. I'll oh, rip the whole window off. What? No! Come back! Please come back! We're going home. The food's terrible here. No, they bought cookies! Now, boy. <laughs> I think you should give yourselves up. You're under arrest in the name of the law. Law? What law? Yeah, I don't see any law. Then I suggest you turn around. Oh, Please yeah. Sheriff Shrimp. It's Sheriff Shrimp. Yeah, and just about everybody in town, it looks like. Youngsters, that was mighty fine work apprehending these two. I'll be taking them off to jail now. You boys ought to be ashamed of yourselves. Hold on, Sheriff. Who's There's Mr. Big? One more person involved with the rustling. Yeah, that's right. He kept talking to somebody called Mr. Big. I never saw his face, but he was in charge. He planned the rustling and everything. Is that so? Well, what if it is? 
We'll never reveal the identity of Mr. Big. Yeah, you'll never catch him. Actually, I know who Mr. Big is. He's right here in the room. <gasps> when the wrestlers caught Luther and me, they called Mr. Big to come and decide what to do with us. I suspect he was already here when you all arrived and just slipped in with the posse. Well, which one is it then? Hmm. I think Gil Barker is Mr. B. No. Me? Yes. We overheard you talking to a shark about a really big deal you had Lisa, going on. Lisa, your mouth's not moving. Might that deal have had something to do with a certain herd of hogfish? Well, no, actually. The deal I was working on was selling 300 packs of Super Rubber Bubble Bubble Gum to the Squid family here. They reserved my entire stock, except for one licorice-flavored pack. We love the stuff. It kills the taste of the ink. Yeah, it's great. Yep. Oh, so that means hmm. Gil Barker isn't Mr. Big? No, he isn't. But that was good thinking to remember the shark. Lisa? Thanks. Well, if it's not Gil Barker, then which one of us is it? Could be this Mr. One. Big must be Sahara no. Slim. I assure you, I'm not your perpetrator. We saw you sending a telegram. You said, keep them on ice. Yep, that was about some suspects in another case. You see, I'm here undercover. I'm actually Sahara Slim under sea marshal. <laughs> I sure didn't expect that. Who oh, is it? We haven't had like any evidence of the undersea coffee break statutes. <laughs> I guess you're probably not a rustler then. That was smart to notice the telegram, but he's not Mr. Big. So who is? Who's Mr. Big? Who is it? Is it? I suspect Mr. No. Nelson, when we first came to your shop, you were working on something that wasn't a belt buckle. Oh, uh, <clears throat> it was a barbell. In fact, it was that barbell Lisa! right over there, wasn't it? Well, uh, yes, as a matter of fact, it was. I thought it would be good for the hotfish to get some exercise. A healthy body is very important. Are you saying I'm fat? Oh, no, no. I just, um... So that means Nelson Torso is Mr. Big? <gasps> That's right. Yes, yes. Oh, I'm afraid Did I anybody am. else find Just the evidence? Buckles hasn't been doing too well, you see. Since folks don't need very many buckles around here, I thought I might have better luck as a hawkfish rancher. Well, that's no excuse. You all ought to be ashamed. You just should This game's broken. And don't belong to you. It hurts other people, and it's just plain wrong. Yes, yes. We're sorry. We didn't want to be rustlers. All we ever really wanted was to be hogfish ranchers, but we don't know how. Ranchers, you say? You know, I do still need some help out at my place. I'm glad that's worked out so well for everyone. Freddy, Luther, I can't thank you enough for all you've done here. The hogfish are home safe. And the Playing rustlers the is brought to justice. Yeehaw! How's their immunity service working out? That's community service, son. Immunity oh, yeah. service. How's that going? I think they're coming along quite well. <laughs> Get him, hogfish. It's hard work, but when I'm done with them, they'll be real hogfish ranchers. Can we learn to be hogfish ranchers, too? Of course. Here, I've got something for you. Ten gallon hat! Yours is a five gallon, so it'll fit just right. Oh boy! Lisa finally gets his hat. Now come on, you two. I'll show you how to tie a lasso. Alright. So we figured that out. Oh. Do you really want to quit?
Alright everyone, so that's that for today. Uh, thanks everybody so much for watching. We have one more to do, which is the case of the creature of Coral Cove, which was always my favourite. Then I will figure out if after I said we'll do Putt Putt or Pajama Sam. I'm, I have no idea. I just make it up as I go along and I will figure it out. If you guys want to see a certain one next, um, let me know out of Pajama Sam or Putt Putt. Um, I am doing them in order that they were made when it comes to the actual games, but if you'd rather see the Pajama Sam ones first or the Putt Putt ones first, um, that's completely up to you. So, thanks everybody for watching. Uh, we have one more Freddy Fish one to go and then we're on to the next thing. So, thanks everybody and I will see you all next time.